I can't. There it is. Oh, I like that so much better. So you can see me at my desk with my coffee and all the stuff on my desk. Awesome. Okay, so guys, you did it. I am so excited. Guys, this was probably my favorite challenge group. I have ran bigger ones, but um, with just, well, well, there goes that. I think I want a tripod for my phone um, so I can do these videos a little bit so, better. Congratulations, you guys literally killed it this month and I'm just like so grateful and excited for you guys. Um, you did it. You took part in a challenge group for an entire month and I know like it's easy to look at those things and be like, wow, like I didn't, you know, maybe work out as much as I like said I was going to do at first or I didn't do it every single day or I didn't drop all the weight that I was looking to or like I didn't eat well all the time. But you know what? I want to take a moment to celebrate some non-scale victories because I've talked to you guys individually and there have been some progress. There have been days where you have chosen, nope. I'm going to put that down and I'm going to try having some veggies first or I'm going to have water most, um, water first and veggies most. And there's been other times you're like out of sight, out of mind. I'm going to clear out my chips. I'm going to clear out my cabinet um, and just grocery shopping for other things. And so I want you guys to take a second and just be grateful for that because that's huge. I know for myself, I definitely have had some moments where even just this week I was like, I want ice cream and you know what I went and I got ice cream and it was fantastic and I enjoyed it um, but I knew that I've also made choices that were like I'm gonna have some healthy snacks instead or picking up things I didn't buy the chips I bought some carrot sticks instead um, and so just kind of learning engaging I think that that's really important because what we're going for here is a lifestyle right we're not trying to deprive ourselves we're not trying to like Alana says we're not trying to like live a miserable life life this is the whole point we're trying to be healthy so we can live well and so part of living is sometimes having a piece of cake sometimes that is having you know a treat um, but anyway I just wanted to say that that you did more this month than you would have without this group you have done more this month and I've seen you guys as your coach do more than you did before and I think that that is worth celebrating so congratulations Maybe buy yourself a new like workout tank top or a pair of nice leggings um, or something like that or just a nice dinner with a friend to even treat yourself to that um, and just be like, hey, I just want to share something that has been awesome and that I've done for myself. Um, so if you're married, take your husband on a date and maybe be like, or for like a walk and be like, I just want to celebrate things and just share that with somebody that you love that can um, rejoice in that with you. Um, one of my favorite verses in the Bible is to mourn with those who mourn and to rejoice with those who rejoice and I think that's an awesome piece of this like why not you know you just finished a month of kicking butt so way to go you rock um, a couple of other things that I want to share with you guys um, that I'm very excited about so this challenge group went really well and I've actually talked to a ton of other people um, kind of on the sidelines of all of this who also want to get their health into shape um, so I've been working out with my roommate and there's some other girls on this campus some of my guy friends even um, and some other moms that um, are from back home that have reached out and they're like actually I'd really love this and even fun fact my mom um, is she's been texting me and asking me questions and really that's my heart as a coach like I was telling my roommate today that there were so many times when I um, was growing up and as a young teenager that I just didn't know how and I had nobody to help me my family didn't know how to be healthy um, I didn't know what it was to be healthy I was reading articles online and just running myself um, ragged trying to figure out what on earth does it mean for me to be healthy how can I be healthy um, and trying to figure that out on your own is super possible and humankind is amazing and very capable of figuring that out however having a support group also really helps um, and that is really what I'm passionate about I'm passionate about you guys seeing those results you guys being a little bit better um, every time we talk um, and if you're not that I'm here to support you and figure out what maybe the missing piece is so um, definitely like feel free to reach out if 
Um, I haven't been reaching out as much as you'd like me to, let me know. Um, you know, I want you guys to be independent in your journey, but also to have enough support um, that you need. And so sometimes it takes a little bit of tweaking. Um, but yeah, so I mean, it takes some tweaking. Everybody's a little bit different and figuring out the coach to client relationship or friend, depending, you know, you're all kind of my friends, um, <laughs> is sometimes a little bit tricky. But um, yeah, I just wanted to encourage you guys with that. Um, so going forward, now that we've only got a day or two left before all of this wraps up, um, what's next, right? I think that's a logical question and I think it's a good one to ask. Um, and so personally, um, this month has been my month of 21 day fix, um, which is one of the programs that's on beach body on demand, which you guys all have access to. Um, I have finished 80 day obsession in the very beginning of this month. Awesome program. Super recommend it. If you haven't done it yet, um, it's incredible. It is incredible. You will see changes 100%, uh, even if you like cheat and things like that, like it is seriously so I saw so much change in my body it was amazing um, and I got so strong like I can do push-ups for the first time in my life what what <laughs> um, so yeah that was exciting um, but going into this next month there's a couple of things that I wanted to announce um, so there's a couple of deals that Beachbody is doing um, one of them is lift four so that is one of the newer programs that came out after 80 day obsession and they um, do four workouts a week for 30 to 40 minutes not bad you get three rest days um, so for those of you guys who are still trying to tone up your body and your muscles um, that's a great program uh, my coach is doing it a bunch of people on my coaching team um, also are doing it I'm considering it that's one of the ones that I'm looking at um, after I finish 21 day fix um, but yeah, I know a lot of you guys in this particular group really focused on the 2B mindset. And I think that's an amazing launch pad, an amazing foundation to begin um, your health journey. So I'm really excited that you chose that one. Um, but as we saw today on today's post, exercise is extra credit, but also so good for your body. Um, being able to continue to be strong and to use your muscles and strengthen your bones um, because of your working those things um, really is so good for you. Um, and so I just encourage you guys to begin looking at that. Um, if you have any questions about which one to pick or to choose, or maybe you're not sure, you're like kind of nervous about which style, um, there's so many options on Beachbody On Demand, hundreds, literally hundreds. There's yoga, there's Pilates, there's um, super intense stuff like Insanity, um, Ant Lip 4, and AD Obsession, and so many options. They're actually getting ready to launch Shift Shop again, um, like a remake of it. There's dancing ones, there's like country kinds of dancing, then there's hip hop dancing if you're feeling really fresh and cool. Um, so, so many options really, and I've kind of dabbled in a bunch of them, it's so fun. Honestly, Lift 4 is a great option if you want to have a program to stick to, and if you're feeling some extra stuff throughout the week, you know, do a shift shot, do an 80 day obsession workout, see what you think about it just to get a vibe on it. So, um, I would encourage you guys in that, and definitely I'm here if you have questions, as always. Um, the other couple announcements that I wanted to share with you are um, Pumpkin Spice Shakeology. Hello! <laughs> it's fall. I love Pumpkin Spice, and so that actually has sold out in the U.S., but they're restocking it. So if you're interested in that, um, that is on your Beachbody um, Shakeology order if you would like to try that um, and get in on that. I'm really excited about it. Um, I have not ordered mine yet, but I will. You better believe I will. <laughs> um, the other thing is um, that Lift 4 is on sale $10 off still until the end of September. So the 30th of September is the cutoff. Um, if you want to do that, you'll save $10 on your challenge pack. Um, also, Miss the Mass is $10 off until the end of the month, I believe. Um, and a couple other packs, challenge packs are on sale. So take advantage of that. $10 is $10, you know. Um, so definitely just wanted to share those deals with you guys because I don't want you to miss out. Um, anything else? Oh, last thing. Um, drum roll, please. <laughs> Um, since this challenge group is finishing up, I think it's only right to have another one. 
you guys killed it. Um, I would love to have any feedback that you guys have about what you liked in challenge groups, what challenges you enjoyed. Um, so I'll be asking you guys that personally, or you can leave it down in the description box below in the comments. Um, but I would love to know what you want more of. If you want more recipes, or you want more um, just cute motivational posts, or personal things, um, let me know. So yes. I am so excited. I'm excited to begin our next program together, um, figuring out together as a team what that might look like for us. So um, with that, I just want to share a little bit of a devotional thing because I think that coaching has been awesome for me in a lot of ways. Um, and one of those ways is um, part of my job is to take care of my body and my mind and my soul. And so I want to share a little bit of what that's been looking like for me. Um, I've recently done um, version, so that's uh, an app on your iPhone, or I think they have it for Android also. Um, it has devotionals, and they're amazing. Um, they're like three days, five days, seven days. Um, those are the ones I've been picking personally, because I can jump topics until I find something I like. I just finished one um, called The Exposition of Jude. Um, it was three days, and you go through the book of Jude, which is like one chapter. Um, and it was interesting, actually. Um, they have a ton of them based on books. Some of them are really great. Some of them, you know, I mean, I guess there's different things for different people. So, um, yeah, Visioneering by Andy Stanley was one that I finished earlier this week. Also phenomenal. Um, right now, that's one thing I'm doing for my spiritual health. Um, and another thing I'm doing for personal development is reading this book. It's Present Over Perfect. Um, and I love it. I got this for my discipleship leaders, actually. Um as like a supplemental thing, as like a gift for them um, to grow themselves. And I have only read like the first two or three chapters and it's phenomenal. It's a good before bed book, a good in the morning when you first wake up book. Um, I've been trying to start and end my days with both reading and prayer. Um, and so I get to pray for you guys, which I love. Cause can't we all use a little more prayer? Um, and also being able to grow and read and reflect has been, um, really good for me personally. So I encourage you guys to do that. Maybe pick up a book like Present Over Perfect. Um, I also finished a couple other ones. I read a lot of books at the same time, like simultaneously. I'm that kind of a person. Um, my residence director gave me this one. It's a Bob Goff book called Everybody Always. Um, and I'm excited to start digging into this one. I think I'll like breeze through this one. So um, super excited. It's about loving people. Um, it says becoming love in a world full of setbacks and difficult people very relatable. <laughs> so I hope that's encouraging to you guys. Um, I'll add you guys to the next challenge group. Also set some goals with you guys. I want to say a shout out to Cindy. Way to go. You've been killing it with your Shakeology and water goals. Um, drinking more water. Rainy, I just want to encourage you. You did great with your yoga the other day. Um, way to just get out there and try something new. Um, Deep Chica, always want to encourage you. You are amazing. Such a great friend. Um, and also just feeding yourself positivity. One thing I love about you is you're always learning. And I think that's so important. Um, so just wanted to shout out you three um, in particular. So way to go. Keep it up, ladies and gentlemen. Um, keep it going strong. You guys are incredible and awesome. And congrats on finishing your first challenge group with me. Bye. Okay, I'm on the first floor of um, my dorm and right by the parking lot and so I'm definitely like all excited and talking on the phone but they can't see that there's a phone here and so it literally looks like I'm just talking to somebody lol they're probably making on their car oh awkward <laughs>